All right, it is official. I am now a good little slave for the New World Order. I have my brand new New World Order. What do they call this weird looking driver's license? Two fucking years. These licenses are good for two years. Uh, the last license I had was good for seven years. I had only used uh, half of it, so I traded in a license that had four years on it for one that has two years on it. So I guess every two years you have to come in and be a good little slave. And uh... <laughs> So this is how I, I started my day. Well, not how I started my day. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So I go to clean out the tiny house uh, <laughs> where this <coughs> young couple was staying last night to find the empty we have the empty uh, tube of KY tingling personal lubricant give me goosebumps give me goosebumps I'm not sure it's goosebumps that that young couple was looking for now did I say it is a gorgeous it is a fine it is a beautiful fall day here in the end times that is a Saturday it is Saturday October 15th and these leaves are still beautiful and it's been a glorious October so anyway I'm so glad I went out there and looked under the the bed cleaning up the tiny house for the next young couple to come in with their own tube of fucking give me goosebumps personal lubricant it's so glad to be so happy to be running the uh the bugs in a jar the bugs in a jar uh what do you call it not exactly whorehouse but uh i'm so glad that somebody at bugs in a jar is uh <laughs> is enjoying the bed in the tiny house so this new couple is uh, this young couple they look like they're about 17 so they just showed up and uh so they i could tell they were a little bit taken aback by how small the uh how small the, the tiny house is. So I took them up to the new one and said, guys, this one's over twice as big. I said, but you understand there is no heat. It's going to be 35 degrees tonight. I thought I said, you understand there is no heat up here. Uh, there is no heat and it's a long trip to the bathroom and uh, I could see them eyeing each other out of the side of their eyes and they said uh we're from buffalo we're from buffalo was their response to there being no heat so uh <laughs> and then uh they told me two hours ago that they were heading off to a hike now the finger lakes trail I saw them disappear into the new tiny house, you know, with the big bed, and uh, <laughs> that's the last I saw of that young couple. Oh, to be young and in love, hell, to be old and in love. I'll take being old and in love. I've actually gotten, uh, <laughs> I have gotten two hits from Pile of Fish this week so who knows maybe uh maybe there is still hope for the hopeless oh god young and in love the whole damn world waiting at their fingertips i'm gonna let this guy richard petty pull over here my new driver's license uh, 
thinking about the message from the universe over this uh, goddamn uh, expired registration. And now what I'm dealing with is finding somebody who will, you know, work on my camper. I need a bunch of work done on the goddamn camper. I still don't know if I need a new fucking $2,000 axle. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. You know, I have nobody to travel with. Uh, I am actually thinking, the thought is crossing my mind, do I dare spend a winter in upstate New York? Because, <clears throat> It's looking more and more like it's going to be December before I get this goddamn bullshit with this uh, inspection from the DMV dying. And, and once the snow starts blowing, uh, you know, hauling that goddamn camper out of here uh, in the snow ain't going to happen. So uh, I am actually wondering what it would be like to uh, spend the winter here. I'm going to get one of these uh, heaters for the new tiny house. You know, one of these new portable propane heaters. So I'll have two new tiny houses. And uh, so if I can have heat in all three of them, I don't know, guys. It's just, uh, it's this bullshit with it getting dark at 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, this is what it's going to be, where it's going to be getting dark here pretty soon when they roll the fucking clocks back. So anyway, I still do not have any clue what I'm doing for the next six months. Oh, all of these choices. So, uh, I guess one of these women who answered my, uh, pile of fish ad, she is heading to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina for the winter. I know another uh, pile of fish date I had earlier this summer. She is thinking about going to Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Uh, it looks like Florida <laughs> is not uh, very attractive, so the snowbirds are uh, looking for Somewhere else. Does anyone out there know anything about Myrtle Beach, South Carolina in the winter? What the hell that looks like. Who knows? Fucking Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Uh, fuck. But right now, I am, uh, right now, I am heading, you will not believe this, I am heading to Home Depot. Uh, get a paintbrush for the stain. I need to uh, start staining my tiny houses to get them ready for winter. So I'm going to start with my five picnic tables. I have the stain, but I don't have the brush. Getting ready for winter. Who the hell knows? Maybe I'll just stick it out right the fuck here. I mean, the, the, the thought of heading out alone in this goddamn trailer is almost as depressing as uh, being stuck here for the winter. You know, it's kind of like six of one, half dozen of the other. Oh, we're so fucked. Get out there and prepare for your own winter of discontent while you still can. Oh my God.